Hey everybody and welcome to Mr. Oz's Fish Room. I'm going to do a little segment today on my uh, Celestial Pearl Danio tank um, which is now being shared by a pair of Bolivian rams. Uh, they are the coolest fish. Um, really, they're just awesome. But um, I, uh, I really like the uh, Celestials, um, also known as Galaxy Resboras, uh, and a few other names, Margaritas. Um, the uh, Galaxy Resboras are actually a good dither fish here for the Bolivian rams. And um, now that the Bolivian rams are in here, the uh, the celestials are coming out a lot more as well, and um, it's just awesome. Right now, the dynamic in this tank is, is just amazing. I had to stick a, a UV sterilizer in there. Um, barely fits, but um, this tank gets so much natural sunlight. I just, if I really want to have a gaming chance against the algae in here, um, I'm going to need a little extra help. Um, there's definitely some spawning going on here with the celestials. They tend to like this, uh, I'm, I know I'm going to say it right, this uh, brickia right here which I've tied to a piece of petrified wood and I had to cut the light for a few days because of the algae uh, I'm having a blue green algae issue with a little bit of a bacteria hurdle but um, it's coming along and there's the, uh, the two Bolivian rams right now in the back and you can see I've got some nice male Celestial Pearl Danias. Such a beautiful fish. And then there's the female right there. So they're gonna do a little spawning right now. If I can catch them, get lucky. And then there's one of my rams. These fish are just amazing. They're, a, you know, a little fish. Um, that's why they call them dwarfs, obviously, and they're gonna get a little bit bigger, but um, I think they're gonna also get a little bit more color. Um, they're just, their personalities are amazing. I think I've got two males, it's possible. If anybody wants to comment, please um, feel free to do so. I'd like to hear your opinion, given on the coverage I'm able to get here. Um, let's see. Got one of these cool little cave swarm, and they do love these little caves. Um, I don't know who came up with this idea, but these little caves are perfect. They are just awesome. And, um, I tried to clean up everything here, but because this is actually out of my living room, but you know, I can only do so much. It's pretty cool when I close the cabinet. It all, oops, sorry, that works out pretty well. It's a pretty nice little display. Got a little aqua clear on the back there. I love aqua clears. Um, I mean, aqua clears and the uh, Fluvals C two threes and fours and the um, aqua clear like all the way up to I think the seventies. Yeah, um, not the one tens. They all use the exact same motor, so it's kind of silly. In fact. Not to get off topic, but I found a sale on the motors that are usually like, I don't know, like anywhere from 15 to 
like thirty dollars. I found a bunch of them for like nine bucks, and I just bought like I think like thirty of them. <laughs> I won't have to worry about it again for a long time because I've got like you know all C4 Fluval filters hang on the back and down aqua clears that use the same motor. I will admit though the fluvals are easier to work with. But the um, aqua clears seem to for some reason run a little bit smoother because of their design from where the intake tube goes down into the impeller. That's my opinion. And right now the, the Rams and the Celestials seem to be getting along just fine. zoom in so I can hopefully get some better coverage for everybody so they can see how beautiful these fish really are.
Well, everybody, it's quite a bit of footage, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. And uh, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Just uh, like, subscribe, and uh, let me know if you want to see more footage. And I got another tank full of Celestials. And um, I bet it looks pretty cool. It's got a, a Pistogramma Cockatoides. Uh, they're triple reds. Um, well, the male is visibly a triple red, and um, I have a nice little female friend for him in there, um, and uh, I'm going to do that as another video here, hopefully today. Alright, until next time.